Welcome to Bay Sunday. I'm your host, Kenny Choi. A lot in store this morning, but first, a trip back down memory lane. The Temptations are considered the greatest R&B group in history, and now there's a play that brings them back to life. It's called Ain't Too Proud, and here with, this, here with me this morning are its stars Derek Baskin and Jeremy Pope. Welcome to Bay Sunday. Hey, hey thanks doing? for having us. It's uh, good to have you with us. Um, so Otis Williams, the only surviving member of The Temptations, yeah. I heard you had a chance to actually meet him to prepare for this role. Yeah, yeah, it was amazing. He came by uh, really early in our rehearsal process just to see what was going on and uh, keep tabs on us, I would say. And uh, <laughs> he really imparted some great, great knowledge and just the old stories. And he's really invested because we're essentially telling his story. Mm -hmm. um, and he's just an amazing person to get to know. And I feel so honored to uh, play him every night on stage. Yeah, no, that's fascinating. And Jeremy, you also had a chance to meet him, but you also said that you learned about some of the of what the Temptations were all about. Yeah, it was incredible. He, um, couple, uh, we sat in a hotel room in his hotel room, and he just told us stories, and yeah. just amazing to hear um, the journey he's been on, and so inspiring. You know, he's still performing to this day with yeah. the temptation. So, you know, that fire that he had, that he still has to keep doing that, it was just amazing. I've never experienced anything like yeah, that. Yeah, something to yeah. see that passion. Yeah. We, have a, we have a clip uh, yeah. of the trailer. Let's take a look at it, and then we'll okay. talk more about it afterwards. I know you want to leave me, but I refuse to let you go. If I have to beg, please, for your sympathy, I don't mind, because you mean that much to me. You definitely have to kind of get into the music, <laughs> but the Temptations, it, I mean, it seems like everyone knows them. Um, what was it like preparing for, for these roles? Grueling. <laughs> <laughs> we both had boot camps. Oh, okay. yeah. Dancing yeah, yeah. boot camps. But you knew uh, the songs before. We knew the oh, music. Yeah, Some of them songs, yeah. yeah, you know the music, and yeah. it's very familiar, but those moves yeah, and to get yeah. your body to do that. So. Yeah, it's not my, not my forte <laughs> dancing. Yeah, so gotta go they, to the gym to kind of get oh, ready for those, man. that Yeah, yeah you know, it's, it's, you it really up. is, you know, we're, we're athletes there, you yeah. know, we're, we're singing, we're dancing. Doing splits. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> all of that. <laughs> gotta, <laughs> gotta do some yoga beforehand. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. absolutely. Get your mind right, you yeah. know, out of that. <laughs> um, what did you learn about the Temptations that you kind of didn't know about them before? Is there anything that you kind of found striking or something that surprised you about the group or even Otis? Well, I would just say what's so heartwarming about The Temptations is how much uh, I related to them, um, just as artists, as, uh, as men, as black men, as um, the passion they have for the music, as the passion they have for uh, telling a story, they're storytellers. Mm. Um, and I, I really connected with that. And I thought it was really heartwarming. I, I guess I just never compared myself to a temptation before. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, it, it, it has just really been enlightening and heartwarming, just how much artistry, um, how much love for the art they have. Mm. Yeah. You know, it seems like this show is more about than just the music. There's a story as well. Yes, yeah. you get to meet um, these individuals and, you know, see the highs and the lows of, you know, this, this amazing group. Mm -hmm. um, and I think that's just so special um, to share and to be on that stage and to, to see that and witness that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Our playwright, her name is uh, Dominique Morisot. She tells a great story and there's a line she has and um, toward the end of the show and it says that the, the temptations helped to integrate the nation. Yeah, you mm -hmm. know, during music, this, you're right. Yeah, you know, they, they uh, I remember Otis telling us a few stories about that too, doing some concerts down in the South when there would be like ropes in yeah. between the white audience and the black audiences and, and they kind of helped get rid of that where they would stop doing concerts if they had those. Right. Yeah, um, right. And so like, uh, you know, just what they meant to this country historically has been just amazing. No, that's, a, that's fascinating. And, mm -hmm. and I'm just trying to picture that setting where you have that rope in between, yeah. where both crowds are enjoying the music. Enjoying the music, And perhaps exactly. forgetting about you know, color and, mm -hmm. and racism yeah. at that time. Um, it's a fascinating uh, show, and you got a chance to meet Otis. You also saw him in concert. I find it amazing <laughs> that he's still singing. He's not lip syncing. No, he's, Otis no. is the real deal. Those Temptations are the real deal. Yeah. I'm trying wow. to tell you, yeah, we got to see them. We ran after rehearsal and took this van, and we, we, we didn't think we were going to make it. Yeah. Yeah. And we were like, we just got to go, yeah. even if we just see him after the show. And yeah. we caught it 
right in time and we got to see every song they performed um, which is also on our show and that was just amazing to see them right. up yeah. there doing their thing in them sparkly suits. Man. Ooh, they're so clean. Man. So now you guys are both inspired to perform until you're 70, 80, 90 hey. years old. Like, kind of like <laughs> I, I don't think I'm going to I don't think I'm going to I don't know if dance. I got the splits that long but uh, <laughs> yeah, training, I'll try. Right. I'm going to try. Derek, Jeremy, thank you so much for uh, joining us here this morning. Thank Congratulations. You. Thank you. Remember, uh, Ain't Too Proud, The Life and Times of the Temptations is playing at Berkeley Rep through November 5th. For tickets and more information, you could go to berkeleyrep.org. Coming up, Project Runway's Lawrence Boss and Fashion on the Square when Bay Sunday comes right back.